the next fun room. Oh yeah, this one. Shoot that down. Hmm. Too bad we couldn't do that in the first Resident Evil. We had to instead push a fucking staircase up to it and climb up there and grab it. Yeah, it was the red jewel that got you the magnum in that game. Ha ha! Okay. Easy as hell puzzle. Sacrifice. It's 4 3 2 1. Yeah, it is. It's 4 3 2 1. It's like the fucking easy. It, it's just the reverse. <laughs> I mean, yeah, okay. That was real hard. Yeah, right. Real challenging. Not... Um... Why am I looking at the map? It's irrelevant. Let's go. I know where I'm going. I can only go through one door. What a pleasant surprise. But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise, but I'm only 20 years old. So you're just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get rid of our American friend. That's it, Salazar? Only six guys? Whatever. They, he didn't lock this door, so we'll use this as a choke point. Which makes sense, because there's like six guys out there, and there's also there are crossbows as well. Look at this. Wait for these morons to open the door, because it's rocket science. Fuck you. Idiots. <laughs> if you don't know about this door, though, you might be in for a fight because, uh, yeah, you're you, they you're surrounded immediately. It's pretty much find the door, make your way through it to get out of the, the, any immediate danger and regain control of the situation. See, I, I have control of this engagement right now. Duh. But um, you know, first time playing, it's like, oh shit. Oh shit, I'm surrounded. You know, I might think, oh shoot, you know. No, break to the right and go through the door. These idiots. He, he's dead. Did I just shoot that guy through the door? I bet I did. Some of Leon's weapons actually shoot through doors, surprisingly. You're dead. You are dead. When they go flying back like that, you know they're obviously dead. <laughs> yeah, they're dumbasses. Oh, oh, I hope you didn't enjoy their head. Here comes more crossbows. And these guys are really annoying here, too. No, nope, stay back. One thing I don't like to do, actually, is open doors when I know there's an enemy around it. Even though you'll see me do it more than once, like I just did right there. Because, uh, I'll, you know, like I was saying before, there's no invincibility frames in this game. I mean, I think I talk about that in greater detail. Yeah, look at that shit. Get shot with a crossbow and grabbing that. But, uh, there's no invincibility frames at all. The only time Leon's invincible is when he's, like, climbing a ladder. That's pretty much the only time he can't be hit. I'm th I mean, there might be one other time, too, he can't be. When he's grabbing an item, but that brings up a menu screen, so, yeah. He doesn't exactly... yeah, but... So, if you kicked... I'm trying to shoot the fucking thing above him. I'm, yeah, I failed life, what's new? Stupid crossbow. Yeah, he can burn to death. But, uh, yeah. So... You'll see it happen a couple times where I'll open a door or I'll jump a gap or something, and it, as I'm recovering from that action, I don't, you know, I can't raise my weapon because I'm still recovering. I just got hit with a rocket and it didn't kill me. How about that? <laughs> but um, as I'm recovering from said action, an enemy will be right there and just smack me. You know, it, it, it's unavoidable because what the only, well, it would have been avoidable if I had uh, t dealt with the enemy before making the move, but you now. 
You know, being that there's no invincibility frames during recovery time, you got to be careful with doors. Which is why a lot of times I don't like to open doors if I know there's enemies on the other side of them. I'll make them come to me, that type of deal. That way they can't put a cheap hit on my ass when I open the door. But even still, I'll get hit doing that from time to time. It happens. Because, you know, I get impatient. It's like, come on! Now look at this shit. I have a valid target, but I can't see it because the... For some reason, the pole in the foreground is blocking you. And you, now you see why I say these guys are annoying. They constantly run from you. Constantly. <laughs> it's like, it's okay for them to have a shot on you, but as soon as you have a valid uh, a, a shot on them, they run. They're like, oh, no, Leon's going to shoot us! You fucking ass clowns. See, he's going to run away now, like a little bitch. But I'm not going to let him die. There. Hooray. Okay, that clears out these idiots. That's exactly what they were, as a matter of fact. There's a spinal here, I'll take that, thanks. Now, what we need to do... Grab this bullet. Damn. That is still funny how I got hit with a rocket launcher and it didn't kill me. <laughs> it actually won't unless you're low on health, but... I thought I was low on health, so I'm kind of surprised. It must not have been a direct hit. A direct hit surely would have killed me. Yeah, I mean, you can come down here and try and hold that and fight him off from in the beginning there if you wanted to, but... Deactivate the security system, which brings this up. Great. I need that, what's in that chest. So we're gonna go... Oh, shit, guys with rockets, again. Excuse me. Yeah, they didn't even have a target. But that isn't the last of them. Now there's two more guys with rockets launchers, and I'm not going to go outside. I'm going to stand right here. Because they will get impatient and they'll shoot. Watch what happens. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Somehow, yeah, they they just blew up the wall. Watch this. Their one bullet kills. Isn't that weird? Yeah, they both fired a rocket at the door, and I guess the door is made out of some sort of fucking high-grade steel or something because they didn't even blow the door off the hinges or do any damage to the environment at all. Isn't that funny? But yeah, if you go out that door, it's not fun. You can get killed immediately. Because they'll both be sitting there with rocket launchers, and it's like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, right. I Oh, by the way, I got the first piece of the Chimera. Yay. Hmm. Where am I at? Uh-huh. Okay, yep, I remember. I'm by the free magnum, sort of. Kind of, sort of. Yes. There's also a treasure in that room with the free magnum, so, I mean, you want to go back for it anyway, even if you don't want the magnum. A whole bunch of crows in here, but I don't even concern myself with them. I'll just take that spinal. I will, however, shoot the crows up here, just because they're easy kills. Uh, right here on the fountain. Two, three, okay. I'll take those. Give me that shit. <laughs> See that? That's money right there, guys. That's lots of money. Making sure I got them all. Yep, we got them all. Anyway, over here is this door we can't get into. Yeah, the Magnum's in that big chest in the middle. There's shit in there. There's, like, there's a yellow in that chest, and there's a... There's like four chests in there. Yep, exactly. We need Ashley to get in there. So, we're not getting in there yet. And it's nice. I'm going to put these barrels here for me to break. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will take that. Ho hum. Come on, stupid, let's go. Through the door. Into the next room.
Ah, the garden. Fun. Salazar's Maze Garden. Yay! What am I doing? Yeah, switch to the shotgun. Very good. <laughs> Although, actually, I think the fucking... Red 9 would work here, too. Well, yeah, to an extent it would. Mr. Kennedy. Still alive, I see. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends, like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Huh. They're an intruder besides me? Yes, Leon, there is, but don't worry, we'll find out real soon. Salazar's pets are, yeah, doggies. <laughs> Very mean ones, too. That's why I have the shotgun equipped. Oh, look at that. Shotgun shells. How convenient. Although the Red Nine can kill them, too. I think I killed the first one with the Red Nine. There's one. Yep. <laughs> the Red Nine can handle them, as long as you don't get overwhelmed by them. I can hear them growling all over the place and shit. I mean, they, they're... they're we're going to get ambushed in here a few times. Look, this one's being in a cage, so we're just going to shoot it in a cage. That one took a lot of bullets. Now, the sound mix here is really good, because I don't know where... You know, first time playing, I know where the dogs are, obviously. I've played this a gazillion times, but... First time playing, you're not going to know where all the dogs are. And it sounds like they're all over the fucking place. If, you know, I'll stop talking for a second, you can hear what I mean. See what I'm saying? I mean, it's like, the, according to the audio mix, you know, it makes it sound like the dogs are all around you. You have no idea where they are, you know, first time playing this, which is, you know, it's actually brilliant. Because it adds a creepiness factor to it. There's a lot of shit to pick up in here, too. I'm, also, I'm after a couple of key items, which I'll get, but there's all kinds of other stuff to get as well. I mean, like, there's a couple treasures in here, I think. Yeah, this, got the spinal already. I don't think I want to go this way yet. Eh, do I? I kind of have a way of doing this. Did I get the one? No, I don't think I did. I need to turn around and go back the other way. Yes, go back the other way. Good, at least I remember doing that. Just trying to remember where the do I'm at the moment. It looks like I don't remember if there was a dog there or not. <laughs> First aid spray. We'll take it. Noob spray. There's one. Yeah. Okay. Your shotgun's doing a lot to it when it's that far away. You dumbass. Right. Fuck the shotgun. <laughs> <coughs> It sounds like there's one right around the corner, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Don't want to go that way yet. There is one right here. Actually, I think it's behind me. Yep. Luckily, it was stupid and didn't attack. I mean, it had a fucking clean shot on me. And there should be a dog in front of me, too. I think. If I remember correctly. No, they're in the cage there. Right there. Yeah, I just kind of pointed that direction. <coughs> Back here's a yellow. Yay, I'll take that. 
Oh, goody. We got a couple of those in reserve. That's good. Now where I needed to go is down the next aisle. I missed it, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Turn back around, stupid, and go down, take Leon's first left. <laughs> right there, there you go. Oh, look at that. Another one of the elegant mask piece. Yay! I know, I'm, I'm excited. We'll just combine that shit. I like that I have one of every jewel already for the next fucking butterfly lamp, too. That's convenient. Um, now I think I want to go over the middle. Uh, yes, no, do I? Yeah, I do. Go over the middle, stupid. <clears throat> I know where I want to go, but do I go there? Now I'm looking at the map, probably thinking, maybe I was showing the map so I could allow myself time to give a fucking 20-minute speech on where to go. Well, maybe I should go this way first, and then go that way, and then this way, and see, I don't know where I'm going here. Why I'm heading back this way. Oh, uh, yeah, now I know why I'm heading back this way. So I can get these dogs. That one I forgot about. <laughs> it was not very... It didn't want to play nice either. There's one behind you too, Leon. I wonder if I realize it yet. Yeah. Yeah. That one mutated, but I don't care. I'll take that ammo. Thank you very much. Yay, doggies. Now, I need to reload. Would be in my best interest to do that. Oh good, I have eight magnum rounds. I don't know why I'm staring at my menu here. Yeah, uh, there's three dogs in there. A couple of them already mutated, which is going to be good, because watch this shit. No, grab a fucking flash. Oh, they were all mutated, I think. No, yeah, they were. Awesome! Look at that shit. They're all done. Yay me. Nothing like saving some ammunition, I suppose. Now, uh, which way do I want to go? Do I want to go that way yet? No, I don't think so. I want to go this way first. I think there's shotgun shells back here. Yes, shotgun shells. And a dog that tries to ambush me, but... Whatever. Two dogs. Oh, shit. Forgot about the second one, but whatever. It is gone now. Hooray, I am happy. These dogs don't like to play nice. They try and catch you with your pants down, I guess. Why am I examining my shotgun? I don't know. I just felt like doing that, I guess. Yeah, go this way, fuck it. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I have to do this eventually anyway. One, one of the key items I need is right here on this fountain. And there isn't anything else here, but there's going to be a couple dogs waiting to say hello to me now. Yeah, mysteriously they just appear out of nowhere. Ah, he got behind me, shit. Not good. Yeah, there's three of them, that's great. Well, let's even it out a bit. <laughs> I like how the flash also knocks the non-parasitic one down. That makes things a little easier. Why don't you go ahead and grab them shells there, buddy. There we go. I missed something to the right. Yeah, I did. You can see it from the stairs. I mean, it's like, duh, dumbass. How dare you miss that? Peter Griffin is golfing with death right now. <laughs> Funny. Yeah, family guy. Big Bang Theory doesn't come on for like another 20 minutes. And you know, Bones is over, there's an NBA game on, so... And it's like, eh, NBA or Family, family Guy, and... Yeah. 
Okay. I gotta get back to the fucking... Yeah, I'm actually almost there. Right here. That's where I need to be. This other overpass. Where the second piece is that I needed. Thank you very much. You know, jump down and just leave. Because we're right by the exit. How about that? Not real difficult, Salazar. Just some annoying little doggies. Anyway, we'll go ahead and put these together. No, no, I don't want the Chimera piece. Put these in here, enter the door, and play catch-up. As, as soon as I decide to go in. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Advice. Try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Ada. So it is true. True? About what? You, working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> See you around. Ada! Come on, Leon. She's never listened to you. Why would she start now? <laughs> anyway, yeah. We'll be back in a little bit.